Guys, what are we looking at today? Well, we're looking at possibly the weirdest out the front knife I've ever seen. This is the Uzi. Now, let me look it up. This is the Uzi collapsible black serrated fixed blade knife with sheath. That's its only name. So let's take a look at it from above because this thing is weird. All right, guys, as you saw in the intro, this one is a lot of fun. I, I, I'm I'm on the fence about this knife because it is so unique. It is a USA made knife, by the way, but this is the weirdest out the front knife I've ever seen. It's not really an out the front auto. It's not a gravity knife. You have no mechanism on the knife itself. The only way to close this knife is to put it in and those little forks allow you to lock it down in and it is kind of cool. So what you have here is a collapsible, as they call it, knife and it's done in um hc stainless uh that's all it says but it is made in the united states this was at the arrowhead forge uh, apparently it's a closed facility now uh this is moser design uh cryo edge now this thing is really really thin and it's unique looking and it is a lot of fun i'm not gonna lie this came to me as way as of a gift for content from one of my subscribers so you have kind of a cool concept here. You have a collapsible knife that locks as you pull it out of the blade. So it is technically an out the front. The blade is inside the handle until you pull it out and it locks. So the only thing that you can do to close it is there's two little pins that go in there and they disengage the blade. I will say it's a unique concept and it's not an unattractive knife really it's got a really good look to it it is in pretty thin blade stock it definitely needs sharpened i i would imagine that in and out this does not have the kind of uh tolerances and uh, oversight a qc to prevent it from dragging in and out so it definitely has a chewed up edge on it but imagine if i sharpen this this thing would get pretty sharp because it's pretty thin blade stock that comes really thin behind the edge it is half serrated which in my opinion, is garbage. But just the whole concept of this is really cool because you don't necessarily have to worry about this having a mechanism where you'd get in trouble or it being a gravity knife. It's just technically a folding knife, but it kind of bridges the gap between a fixed blade and a folding knife. The sheath does come with some long straps. You can actually strap this around your leg. The straps don't, there's no like actual slots that these straps go through. You can strap this around uh, around your leg if you wanted. I, actually, I think these straps are a little small for that, but you probably could. But you can absolutely strap this to gear and stuff like that. And you've got a really cool little package. And like I said, interesting concept. Interesting concept. Now, I'll say that the sheath is definitely heavier than the knife. But this is this is not a good quality product. But just for fun, being a unique and unusual knife, you can see here I'm having – it's – it's a pain. It is a pain to get back in the sheath. Um, but yeah, just that you can be able to have that and then pull that out. That is absolutely unique. It looks like a magic trick. So um, would I recommend this? I don't know. They're apparently uh, no longer in production. I think the place where they had these made, uh, Arrowhead Forge, like I said, or Arrowhead Knife Company, is uh, out of business. And these are, uh, these are sold out and discontinued. But like I said... It's such a cheap production. It doesn't even have an actual name. It's just 8.75 inch collapsible black knife. Um, and so that's all they had it on their, on their website. So I just thought I would show it to you. It is a lot of fun. Um, I am going to sharpen this up. We may see it in another video when I do some more weird knives. But, you know, I do like the outside the, you know, outside of the box kind of thought concept on it because it is kind of neat to tell you the truth. I don't hate it. I really don't hate it. I, I think it's it's pretty cool. So you can see the blade. The blade stays in that spot there until it locks in. My concern would be that this is eventually going to fail and the lock mechanism is not going to lock. And it does have a lot of slop and play in it. You can absolutely feel that uh, the liners moving and everything. So it's just probably ABS plastic that's going to break down over time. But there you go. One of the weirdest knives I've ever had come in. So let's turn this around, do some final thoughts and send you out about your day. So like I said, this is this is uniquely weird. It's the weirdest out the front knife I've ever seen. I don't know whether I would consider it's a fixed blade because there's no mechanism for you to close it other than to use the sheath. So I'm not sure, but I mean, it is, 
It is interestingly odd. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you liked the videos, give them a thumbs up. If you don't like them, give them a thumbs down, but please try to tell me why, because I can't change the content if you don't tell me what you don't like. If you want to support the channel, it's as simple as like, share, subscribe, drop a comment, hit the bell icon. If you do hit the bell icon, make sure you set it for all and make sure you've got notifications turned on your device or you will not get notified of everything I put up every day. Um, the best thing you can do for any channel are the likes. It pushes up, up the algorithm. The closer you are to a one-to-one -one of you to like ratio, the better a video does. So like the videos if you like them. If you want to support the channel financially, please, by all means, use any of my affiliate links down below. Coffee Brand Coffee has a 5% discount already built into that uh, affiliate link. But if you just want to go to their website, you can use the coupon code Crazy Sharp. It gets you the same discount. All in word, Crazy Sharp, save you 5% on some of the best coffee out there. And the Amazon affiliate links, anything you purchase. You don't have to buy the stuff I've got listed. Please, if you're going to do some shopping on Amazon, it doesn't matter whether you're wearing, buying baby wipes or, or broom closet supplies. Just click on one of my links and use it as a portal to my affiliate store. I still get credit for it as supports the channel. If you want to support the channel in a different way, I do have a membership down below. All the members have access to my Gilded server, which is just like Discord. It's a lot of fun. Baseline and premium tier members have access are automatically entered into a giveaway that I do on the Gilded server. And the premium tier guys have access to a sharpening tutorial series I built for them here on YouTube behind that paywall. Sorry about that. Behind the paywall. So, guys, that's it on this one. Keep it clean in the comment section. It makes it easier for me to moderate the channel. Uh, if it's your birthday, happy birthday. I love you, and I'll see you in the next video.